from the Lakeside Newsroom of the Henrico Citizen, your hometown news source since 2001. This is the Henrico News Minute with publisher Tom Lapis. TSA officers stop a loaded gun at Richmond International Airport. And more than 150 businesses show up to help students learn more about potential career choices. We'll tell you about those stories and more in today's Henrico News Minute. It is Wednesday, September 27, 2023. It's brought to you today by Disco Sports. And now for the news. Earlier this month, families and students packed the hallways of Hermitage High School to meet with employers from 150 different companies. It was all part of Henrico School's Life Ready Career Expo hosted by the Department of Workforce and Career Development for the school system. The event was designed to help students explore job opportunities and learn more about different industries. There were businesses from six different career clusters, including business management, arts and communication, health science, human services, industrial and engineering technologies, and natural resources and agriculture. Our education reporter, Leanna Hardy, was there and has a complete report. You can read that right now on our website, HenricoCitizen.com. Last week, TSA officers at Richmond International Airport prevented a Richmond man from bringing his 45 caliber pistol loaded with five bullets onto a flight. The gun was stopped as the man entered the security checkpoint. He now faces a fine of up to $15,000. It was the 12th time officials had stopped a weapon at the airport this year. The airport's now on pace for about 16 of those instances. Should be down from a record high of 24 last year and 21 the year before that. A local nonprofit organization is launching a series of family cafe events for parents, guardians, and caregivers of children through the ages of five. They're designed to help families throughout the region build relationships, learn more about early childhood care, and also understand child care gaps and needs in the community. It's all part of a program from the Thrive Birth to Five organization. The next family cafe will take place October 1st from 2 to 4 p.m. at the Oak Avenue Complex, formerly Highland Springs High School. For details and to register, you can call 804-409-5632. The event is free, but you do have to register, and each event lasts two hours, as mentioned, and families will be compensated with a $50 gift card at the end of the event. The Richmond Metro League of Women Voters and the Virginia Interfaith Center for Public Policy will host a nonpartisan meet-and-greet event on Sunday at Deep Run High School with local candidates who are running for the Virginia Senate and House of Delegates. The event will take place from 3 to 5 p.m. It's intended for open dialogue and is not formatted as a debate. Instead, the candidates who appear will answer questions from the audience. Candidates invited include Senate District 16 candidates Republican Siobhan Donovan and Democrat Schuyler Van Valkenburg. In the 57th House District, Democrat Susanna Gibson and Republican David Owen. And in the 58th District, Republican Riley Shia and Democrat Rodney Willett. Virginia Realtors has released its 2024 economic and housing market forecast, predicting what it says is ahead for the Commonwealth. Those predictions include more than an 11% increase in home sales overall in the coming year, with the median home price in the state expected to increase by just more than 1% when compared with the current year. New housing starts are predicted to increase by about 7%. The organization also predicts a slight unemployment rate climb from about 2.9% this year to 3.6% next year. Some recognition for a Glen Allen woman. Home cook Diane Taylor has been awarded a blue ribbon by Just a Pinch Recipes for her baked chicken and rice dinner recipe. The recipe can be viewed at justapinch.com backslash r backslash ppscn. Fall sports are back, and Disco Sports is your locally owned source for everything you need to get on the field. Save 15% when you buy at least three soccer items. Save on all your 2024 baseball and softball equipment needs, or pick up some new pickleball paddles. Visit discosports.com or just stop by 1400 Starling Drive just off Cuyacuson Road. 
next to BJ's. That's Disco Sports.